Hey guys, what's going on? Back again with another video. It is a Panini 2020 Chronicles uh, NASCAR racing trading cards. Uh, about $20 from Target, like I usually buy them. Uh, picked this up a, a couple days ago. I do have some other stuff coming up. I know uh, not that many people uh, watch NASCAR and racing, but I do have some football and basketball coming up probably on the weekend. And the reason I'm doing this today is because... Um, it only comes with a few cards in there, like 20 cards. Uh, some of the other boxes that I have have like uh, like 100 cards, so I, that might take a little bit longer. But for today, I have a couple of minutes real quick, and I figure I would do this one. And then save the basketball and football cards for uh, tomorrow and Monday when I have more time to record them. Because uh, uh, to be honest with you... I really only have a few minutes, uh, then I gotta do something else. But, and I do love NASCAR. So, and this, like I said, for the price, $20, you guaranteed an auto or mem card on average. I know there have been times that I didn't get one, and then you have to, like, file a claim and, and stuff like that. Um, I think the thick one is that one. I think I hit a, did I hit a, no, I didn't hit an autograph last time, that was something else. Alright, the cards are pretty sweet. They're not numbered though, but they are pretty um, nice looking. And they are I think they're pretty much all refractors, if I'm not mistaken. And so the first one... Oh, they're not. Okay. Uh, well, most of them are, as you can see, coming up. Ryan Blaney. Blaney, sorry. <laughs> Ryan Blaney. And that's pretty much... Uh, and just in case you're not familiar, Chronicles is just a mixture, I believe, of all the other uh, collections. Maybe that they don't do uh, individually anymore. Uh, so that was from Limited. And Jimmy Johnson, I guess this is kind of like the Chronicles base version. Landon Castle. Illusions collection and Richard Petty Panini Crusade like I said some of these are really nice foil looking cards and Kyle Busch from what looks like Phoenix I believe so that was pack one like I said this is gonna be quick there was only five cards in a pack and then uh, only a few uh, packs per box Tanner Gray, rookie card from Score. Uh, Austin Dillon. Oh, you do get short prints. Okay, so this is from Limited, Austin Dillon. And that is 61 of 99. So I think I have to double check the last box because this is the second box of this I'm opening. But the last one, uh, I don't remember getting any short prints or numbered short prints. And this is from. Um, why can't I remember the Oh, status, Panini status, yeah. And that is Chase Elliott. And Martin Truex Jr. from Crusade. And Alex Bowman from, I believe, Phoenix. And this is a prism. A prism refractor I'll have to go and same thing when I do kind of like football I don't know every single player I think for this year I need to go check on uh, how some of these racers or drivers are doing these feel both thick so it should be interesting I know this has something in there, but why does the other one feel thick too? I don't know. Well, this one has the hit for sure, so I'm curious what's in the other one. So for Ascension, Vinny Miller. And let me do it like this because I kind of saw who it was already. Richard Petty from Status. Oh, cool. Always love Danica Patrick stuff. I know some people um, have their thoughts on, on Danica Patrick, but I, 
I don't mind. It's pretty cool. I like the outfit too. That would have been a nice refractor to, to get. Dale Earnhardt from Select. And Danica Patrick was from Phoenix. And NASCAR thing. Uh, let me do this. So the hit, I'm curious what's in the other one. Uh, let's see. I don't know his face. Uh, reserve materials, Martin Truex. Pretty cool. You know, it's funny how everything works out in the funniest ways. We just ha started Halloween season, and <laughs> I know it's gonna sound like a joke, but those are definitely Halloween colors. How ironic and funny is that? Uh, but it, it is a name that I'm familiar with, so that's good. And this is from Cornerstone, Martin Truex. Uh, enclosed race worn used material guaranteed by Panini. So that's pretty awesome that I'm getting a Halloween themed. This might be a decoy unless this is unless I'm just having like and why am I having like the craziest luck the last few days? Uh I tell people and it's a bad example, but I tell people it's like when people buy lottery tickets or scratch offs, it's like you find the store that's giving you the most luck, you're always going to go back there. So I guess the target that I'm going to uh, is g giving me the best luck ever. Uh, so score coal cluster. And oh, that's an awesome looking card. Spectra, Carl Edwards. Oh, okay, this happened last time. That was the, uh, the card. Uh, I remember now. So... Um, it's not luck, but it's still pretty cool. Um, I'm get, I'm guessing, does it guarantee you one every time? Maybe I am getting lucky. I don't even know if you're guaranteed this, uh, every time, but, uh, I did last time, so maybe I'm just crazy. Uh, Spectre Carl Edwards. Oh, and it's numbered. Oh, wow. So this is still good luck. Um, is that the... I'm wondering if it's the... Blaster exclusive green parallels. Oh, okay. Spectra Phoenix more brand. Okay. So this is a really, really, really good hit for a couple reasons. It's one out of ten. And the first card, number one, is always going to be more valuable. And then it's only a short print of ten. And then it's Carl Edwards. And then it's Spectra. And it's a Prism Refractor. So I'll definitely have to sleeve this up. Um, I think maybe eventually down the road... I'll do it for like a crazy giveaway or something like that. Because um, I know there's really diehard NASCAR fans out there. And uh, I love watching it, but I'm not like 100% diehard. I mean, it's great. It's better in person, but I live in a, an area where you can't really go to the races. Um, but if you can go to one in person, there's nothing that beats it for sure. Uh, Ray Black Jr., rookie card. Uh Daniel Hemrick from Select. Spencer Davis from Titan. And that was just um, another, uh, what do you call this thing? When they toned it 500. And so Spencer Davis from Titan. Oh, I like the background, the, the space theme. Hmm. I never knew that was Titan. Maybe I should look into getting some Titan cards. Um, I know they're probably pretty pricey nowadays. But I love that whole, like, uh, space theme. That's pretty cool. I haven't ever noticed that. It must look pretty sweet in, in, a, uh, <clears throat> in a refractor. Um, so anyways, like I said, you get some uh a lot of refractors uh i guess that's the green parallel of sorts uh a couple base cards danica patrick is always awesome like i said to get charlie's angels oh she directed i have to watch that now see that's pretty cool you learn something new every day she rebooted well she was part of the reboot or the director for charlie's angels uh, I know it did horrible in the box office, but I'll check it out on um, uh, for rental or something like that online. 
Uh, so that's a cool one. Um, Richard Petty is a refractor. Um, Alex Bowman's a refractor. That one. Green Parallel. Landel Castle is a refractor. But it definitely is some sort of like a hot box. I'll mention that again for sure. Because this is one, about, one out of ten. Uh, this is pretty cool. Not short printed, but to get two short prints in one box uh, is pretty cool. Because I, I have to double check my last box, and I think I have it right next to me. I don't think that was short printed either, unless I missed it. Because you can almost miss that if you don't see it. Uh, and this is a, a red foil parallel out of 99. So to get three pretty decent cards is pretty nice. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed it.